I'm one of those people who like to start early. I got a military background. Oh, we get take home cars, our equipment's all issued to us. Even the uniform I'm wearing, I don't have to spend a dime of my own for that. So I hop in my car, there's my office, my computer set up. I got my printer right there, We're good to go. In the morning, I'll start off fresh, you know, trying to contact the public. You know, everyone's going to work, you know. My goal is to look for the ones that are kind of in a rush to work and so to help keep the roadway safe. As you put time you're on the road, and then especially now that I'm reaching, I'm at seven years, and the ability to cross train as a road trooper, depending on where you're on the state, there's more opportunities. You can do other specialties to do something different. The ability to move within state is also a big factor. I myself was coming from Marysville, moved out here to the Tri-Cities because my wife got a job in Pendleton, Oregon. But I think, you know, if you really like to work traffic, working with the motor in public, this is kind of something for you. Okay, so I'm just going to give you a warning for the speed there. Not everybody needs to be sighted. So being able to see what's going on, if you can tell that they're having a hard day, sometimes it necessarily doesn't mean a citation. Um, just being personal with that person. Kind of lending that kind of that ear for them because you just don't know what's going on with them. But also at that same time, making that enforcement if it needs to be done. But I really think taking that personal approach, listening to what the other person has to say, being respectful goes a long way. It's honestly a fun job. It's hard to like explain it in words until you actually do it. Because a lot of people don't really know what we do. They just kind of see that trooper that shows up. It's like, where did he show up? What you want to put in is what you're going to get. Because if you don't put in the work, you're not going to get all the fun, exciting stuff that you kind of would like to see. When I put on the Washington State Patrol campaign hat, I think about it over the hundred years of tradition that comes with this. All the hard work and dedication that the people that were wearing this hat for me had put in. And trying to keep those traditions alive, especially what I'm doing now. As a road trooper, it continues on serving the public with humility. And that's kind of what I think of when I'm wearing this hat. And then just going out there and doing what I need to do to get the job done.